Okay everyone, I got wind. This is it. This is the aluminium cans. You can't really see it. All painted black. It actually looks quite nice. I just gotta paint the actual frame. There's a solar panel. And for the people that say that this doesn't might not work. Okay. As you can probably see on this phone, temperature outside. You can't really see it, bugger. It's 22 degrees today, a bit sunny today. Right, the heat coming out of this so far is up to 47, which basically is double. Now, how am I going to plumb this into the house? So, that basically, that's, that's the actual panel, the solar panel there. So, the fan is working. Let's move this. I don't know if you'll be able to see the fan at the bottom probably not it still actually smells a bit of um, you know the paint I was using uh, right basically this that panel is going to go in here I'll we'll basically just sit there okay and then so from that a 22 mil outlet it'll just have a little bend it'll have a little bend that will join this which is then goes to 15 mil goes all the way up to the window up there and it goes right up to there that's basically the window vents there okay so a 50 mil pipe just because I didn't want to drill through to the house so that 50 mil pipe has got loads of holes there up to about there so all this on the other side is all um, it's got loads and loads of holes so I can still open the window and uh, hopefully you know, you don't really see it. There you go, goes up there. And now I have to drill into the house. So all I gotta do is open the vents from the from the inside. And uh, and all this heat will go in there. The paint that I use is barbecue matte black. Uh, this is a massive panel. Uh, 108 cans. And like I said, all, all the stuff that I use here is the proper proper stuff. WBP ply, all the insulation, and obviously the cans. Loads of silicone in between the cans, and I don't know if you can see that. Just make sure there's it, no air leakage. Uh, that's a little 12 volt solar panel. Yeah, and the temperature, yeah, 48 keeps going up as the sun the heat though I, mean, I, I wish I could you know just show you this this is beautiful beautiful heat so this is going to go into the house and uh, heat up my house so far it's only cost me five pounds which is basically for that paint at the moment I'm just letting it run get rid of this, a, a little bit of that smell from the paint from the spray paint I was a bit silly because as soon as I sprayed it waited 20 minutes and I put the window in uh, which as you can still see is still a little bit wet but she's working and I'm happy with it so so far I know as you can see look the temperature is coming down I've moved it from the from the outlet coming down to no, it's 35 it'll probably go down to here on my phone yeah here on my phone is basically 23 degrees this little thermometer that I've got here as well I don't know if you can see that I suppose that this heat thing here will just tell me the outside temperature I'll just, I'm going to leave it there permanently a bit of silicone there and uh, and that big one there will go inside so I can actually see how much heat is coming out. Another thing I'm interested to see with this is the um, once the sun goes down it's how much heat it actually concentrates in there and you know how long until it actually starts going down. Okay I won't bore you with a lot of information I'll just gonna Leave it running probably for today, then tomorrow I can con connect it. Oh mate, the heat. <laughs> okay, look, I'll just do a little test. I still got, I think it's a minute left. 
I'm actually <coughs> at the front of it, so... There she goes. It's actually moving quite fast, this, this thing. She's up now to 35. Ideally, if, if it was a digital one, you could probably see it because then obviously the numbers will uh, will change. I think I'm actually too close to that, I don't know. There you go, she's reached 37. And that's continuously, so obviously, you know, that, that'll just go into the house. A lot of people got their, their heating set at 20 uh, degrees, so imagine having 40 going to the house. So basically your boiler will just have a nice little break. So as I say, proof is in the pudding. So you just saw it going from about 25, which is like the uh, normal temperature outside to now 42, 43, so that's double. See you everyone.